What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time touching down on this channel, welcome to Small Feet Big Heat. We talk sneakers, we talk streetwear, and everything in between. Today I'm coming at you all with my five favorite light jacket styles. These are jackets that I think are perfect for the fall and winter season. I don't want to waste any time, so let's go ahead and jump right in. To start this list off, I have this leather jacket that I picked up from ASOS last year. I got a lot of good wear out of this jacket. It was my go-to for a while. It's great for slimmer fitting outfits. Now, if I want a baggier look like cargo pants or something along those lines, I reach for something else. But in terms of slimmer fitting clothing, this works great with that. I was using this mainly for like nights out. It was great for date nights, going to the bar. I was using it for stuff like that. And obviously, I'm not doing a lot of that in 2020, so I haven't been reaching for this one as much, but it's still a staple in my closet. I don't remember the exact price, but I know this ran me between 140 and 160 on ASOS last year. And that's the great thing about that website is they have a variety of brands. And whenever you have a variety of brands, that means you can find whatever you're looking for at different price points. So if you're on a budget and you need clothing that's a little bit more budget friendly, they have that. Or you can go more mid-range, which is what I would consider this. This is good quality. I believe it was 100% leather. I'll confirm it down here when I double check. But I believe this jacket is 100% leather. And then the inside, the lining, there's not much of a lining. It's like a polyester or nylon lining. So this was kind of mid-range. Obviously, this jacket is not going to last me 10, 15 years. But now that I know I like the style and I was able to check that out on ASOS and figure out whether or not this was a good look for me, I can then buy an item that's more expensive, splurge a little bit on my next one if I choose to. And ASOS has more expensive products as well. So you have all three tiers on ASOS. This isn't an ad. I just shop with them a lot. Also because of their sizing, they have a wide range of sizing this jacket is a 2xs extra extra small i am a skinny and short individual so i need websites and brands that cater to that they also carry tall and plus sizes as well Next, I have this black denim jacket from PacSun. I think both blue and black denim jackets are essential. They're both staples in my closet, at least. However, the black made it to the list because black is just easier to wear. When you're talking about blue denim jackets, a lot of personal preferences come into play. Are you going to wear blue denim with the blue denim jacket? If so, do they match? Are they the same shade of blue? Are they not the same shade of blue? It's all personal preference. And by going with a black denim jacket, you circumvent all of those issues. Now this jacket right here is very plain, all black jacket, black buttons. And that's exactly what I wanted. PacSun is perfect for the essentials. Minimal to no branding is also something that I wanted. So the only place that you can actually see while you're wearing a jacket that it says PacSun is on the little buttons and that's barely noticeable. Another thing is that I purposefully picked this up in a small instead of an extra small from somewhere else because I wanted to make sure I had that layering room. Hoodies underneath denim jackets is one of my favorite looks. Even though black and blue are the go-to colors, denim jackets don't have to be black or blue. I have some patterned ones on the way that are really fire. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe so that you don't miss it. Next is my Supreme Arc Logo Coaches jacket, and this jacket is from Supreme Fall Winter 2011, and I don't say that's a flex or brag or anything like that. I say that because it's been nine years, and this jacket still looks great. On the back, you can see the blue Supreme Arc logo, and I added this one to the list because aside from being one of my favorite jackets, it does add some color to my closet. I know black is easy and it's safe, but I don't want everything in my closet to be black. I also don't have any other jackets that are corduroy, so this is a nice change of pace in material. It's also really warm because it does have this lining inside. You can find coaches jackets and all different types of patterns, materials, colors, 
End Clothing and ASOS are two really great options for coaches jackets because they have such a variety. This one is a newer pickup. I bought it a couple of months ago in anticipation of the colder weather. This is not a traditional jacket, as you can see. It is a fleece jacket, but I think fleece jackets are becoming more and more popular, especially in the last couple of years. Supreme, North Face, Patagonia, especially the more vintage North Face and Patagonias. This is a new style for me, but I'm not afraid to try new things, and you shouldn't be either. I found this on Footlocker.com for $60. It was on sale. It was originally about $120, so I got a really good deal 60 bucks i really like the color blocking that's what drew me to it but it is very warm so it serves its purpose and i'm already starting to look at other fleeces If you keep up with the channel, you saw me give my first impressions of this jacket, and since then, it has been my go-to. This is a Carhartt Whip Varsity jacket that I found on Grailed for about $120 shipped. If you haven't tried out the Grailed app yet, I do recommend it. Give it a chance regardless of what your style is. I guarantee you will find something that grabs your attention. For $120, this jacket is really good quality, which isn't surprising because Carhartt makes good quality products. It's wool, so it is very warm. It serves its purpose as a jacket. And it also has this little pocket on the inside right here. Very nice touch. Having this jacket and knowing how much I like it, I have started to look at other varsity jackets. So I'll probably down the line pick up another color or another style. If you enjoyed today's video and I hope you did, remember to like, comment, subscribe, show a small YouTuber some love, and I'll check y'all out in the next one.